senior day, you go out on your senior's rookie day. It's uh, sort of bittersweet for him. I, I didn't win today, but uh, I know you have a lot of good things to say about him. I do. You know, it's uh, it was tough. It was a, it was a, it was an odd uh, start. Um, even just trying to get families there, and um, it just shows the 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 care of these guys that they have for for their families and for one another. Um, it's just uh, uh, it, it, it's it's you can't talk almost because there's so many thoughts that are coming from the first time we found out we were all going to be together, and that's that's speaking for me. Um, each one of these guys has impacted me in a way that's uh, lifelong. Um, I don't say that lightly. Um, that's why I wanted them all to be in here. Um, they're the foundation of uh, one day when I, you know, my goal is to look up in the corners here and have people um, in those seats. Uh, I think the great Al McGuire said that when I, um, well, years ago uh, for at Marquette. And, uh, and these guys are going to be right there on the court with us uh, whenever that time whenever that time comes. Maybe the foundation. Hundred percent, hundred percent. They if they don't if they don't buy in, just on a personal level, um, I don't I don't I don't personally grow this year. Um, I'm sure some of them would like to me grown a little bit more or a little bit differently at times. Um, but the rea- why are you guys laughing? Hey, oh, why you guys gotta do that? He's tweaking. Um, <laughs> but if they don't if they don't buy in, if they don't buy in to um, uh, you know have faith in in something that had, they had yet seen. Um, I think that right now, some of the emotions that they're they're um, they're feeling, that I'm feeling is, you know, I wrote in one of the timeouts like, you know, you guys are kind of uh, frustrated and flustered, and, and I just wrote care. It's because they care, and um, you know, it's hard to care as much as you do and not ho- understand how to how to you know fix the problem on the court at that time um, without getting your emotions uh, the best of you. What did you learn? Um, I learned how to communicate better, uh, that I need to communicate uh, in, in, in different ways. Uh, they've, they've really shown, um, in my opinion, um, you know, the, I think the thing that they have shown is that uh, I, they demand, um, they have demanded me to, to every day uh, bring a certain kind of energy um, because uh, not just that they needed it, I don't mean by that, but they brought it. Um, I also learned, uh, you know, you, you have to, you have to communicate and coach guys. Um, you got to find different ways to get, to get to each guy. And at the end of the day, I think, um, as cheesy as it is, you know, through honesty, um, that's what you try to do. Now it doesn't always come across in the most gentle way. Um, or maybe, you, you know, you, you, you know, the black and whiteness of, of honesty kind of, uh, um, can cause some confrontation. Um, but at the end of the day, these guys showed up every single day. Okay, that was a little frustrating about a little bit of this game. There was a there was a point where it looked like, oh, we're done. And to their credit, um, you saw a flash of what we were all season today in that little stretch and probably the you know eight minute timeout area. Um, so those are the things that you learn from these guys. Um, and you uh, the thing that I've really learned is that. Um, it's okay to uh, to smile every single day. I think Brandon Jackson's biggest flaw is he's happy. Um, I mean, who am I to sit there and say like, man, stop being so happy? Uh, and I mean that. I mean, he's a he's a he's a he's got a great energy and a happiness about him. Uh, I can go down each one of these guys, but that's. I mean, come on, taught me you, you can be happy every single day, even while you're competing. All right, we talked about this week. And- Yeah, uh, just these few right here. It was uh, because this I was only here for two years, so of course it seemed like I'm the leader. But people don't know Quan won't keep my head straight half the time. (laughs) JB making sure I eat at home (laughs) and the big crab every down there. It's it's like he just makes sure I'm doing right. So um, I think. The thing, like, I don't, I don't even know. What was the experience here like for you? And, and do you see some progress? Do you see the program heading in the right direction? Yeah. Yeah, without a doubt. 
He came in every day, like Bruni said. Challenged all the all the younger guys, the freshmen, him, the coaches, the managers. And it, it's gonna go in the right direction. They uh, they got a lot of talent, a lot of talent. Yeah, yeah, well, but. Granted, mm. not much. You say more games than anybody in the history of SIU basketball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twenty-two games. Yeah. And you're, you're gonna have some good memories from that, I would think. Definitely. I mean, it was it's been a long, <coughs> it's been a long journey. Um, since coming here, um, um, this is the whole story of me even getting here to this point. I just thank God for the whole, the opportunity. You know, I'm so thankful. It's a mystery. <laughs> Just up for the challenge. <laughs> this is uh well I know one thing, uh you know, it's the real world now. Can't be mad no more. Can't say shit. Um, can't just the real world. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, it's the real world, so <laughs> that's a good that was a good one. Yeah, I think the, <laughs> the most important thing we gotta look forward to is you know, we all need to walk off the stage and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Right. And with each other too. So we're not you know one at a time. We're not going one year. Yeah. One year, like summer, May, you know, we're all walking across pretty much the same day. So you're going to start like a family. I mean, we're not family, but I think we might move in. We might move in with each other. <laughs> <laughs> the reality yeah, show with these guys. I think these guys, um, they're, they, you, you, you can literally look. And I, I sit there and I see each one of them and I see a story um, in, in each one of them. Um, you know, selfishly, I see me in their stories. Um, you know, typically it's the first time you meet or, or through the th- first time you see him play. Um, Brandon was the first time that I, you know, was able to walk on campus, JB and Quan as well, and then I saw these guys a little bit more through recruiting. But um, you just sit there and you see a story in these young men, and um, I say it every single game and I mean it every single day. The amount of pride that I have in coaching these guys is a credit to them and their families. Uh, it didn't always go great, all right? It wasn't always smooth. Um, but there has been some very personal uh, interactions um, really with each one of these guys in some capacity um, that is, you know, when, when these guys can impact uh, t- uh, their teammates, each other, their coaches, and their families the way they have in, in this short time here at SIUE, um, it, the, the sky's the limit for these guys to be able to, to take that, um, you know, uh, talent uh, to the real world. Some of them are going to play if they want to play. We got these guys are good basketball players. Some of them are going to really, you know, be leaders. I think all five of these guys can be leaders in some capacity um, what they do. So um, it's a somber situation. It's uh, it's a you know I really wanted to win more with this team, um, and because these guys um, personally on a personal note mean mean uh, mean the world to to me as their head coach. Yeah, you know what they've done uh, after they hit that those shots to beat Murray. They've um, you can see defensively they have really picked up. They pressured. Um, they're playing with a the confidence. Um, they're sharing the ball, um, and, and and to their credit, that's why that's why they they made their little run right here at the end. And they, I think they probably won four, maybe four in a row towards the end. Um, and an extremely well coached team uh, with some good players on that team as well. And they they uh, they were tough today. Okay, gentlemen, thank you all for a great season. It was uh, maybe not wins and losses, but just from, from the way you sat here and I'm sure the fans will enjoy watching uh, the Black Team in Sequence. Thank you all for being so patient. I appreciate thank it. You. Thanks, thank thanks, you. thanks. Thank you.